Wow. Wow, 106 and, and 208? Oh my gosh, and 101 and 102 and 103 and 104 and 105 and 108. Oh, maybe even 109 is here. I think I see 109. Wow, all of my kindergarten and first grade friends are here, Miss Golden. From Jefferson? Yeah, from Jefferson. Wow. Yay, I'm so excited. <laughs> Hi, everyone. Hi, how are you doing, puppy? I miss you. I haven't seen you in a while, you know, because we haven't been able to go to school. Yeah, I really miss you, Snail. And lately, oh, what's wrong? Puppy, are you okay? Well, lately I've been feeling kind of worried. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Hmm, Puppy, I'm sorry to hear that too. I've been a little bit worried too. Raise your quiet hand if you felt worried at all since we left school. I have, yeah, you have. Mm -hmm. I see your hand, you have, yeah. Puppy and Snail, guess what? I'm gonna read a book about being worried. And then we're gonna talk about what to do when we get worried. So stick around and we'll all learn together. Yay, okay, see you in a minute. I'm gonna read a book called, I'm Worried. This book is wonderful and it's written by Michael Ian Black. I'm worried. I'm worried. What are you worried about? The future. Why are you worried about the future? Like, what are you worried about? Like anything. Please tell me nothing bad will ever happen. I wish I could potato, but I can't. Why not? Because nobody knows what's going to happen. Um, now I'm worried. It's okay, you two. Sometimes bad things happen. Like potato. Remember that time you rolled off the table? I was bruised for weeks. <laughs> and Flamingo, remember when you got your beak stuck in the peanut butter jar? Peanut butter is the worst. And that time I fell off the monkey bars and broke my arm? All of those things were bad at first. But over time, they turned out okay. I got a sticker at the doctor's office and it was scratch and sniff. I put bologna in my sandwich and it was delicious. You both doodled all over my cast and it looked awesome. Okay. I'm going to wrap myself in bubble wrap just in case. That way nothing bad can happen again. Guys? 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 It's getting very warm in here. I can't move. We were trapped in bubble wrap. Another bad thing happened. See, worrying doesn't help. Since we don't know what's going to happen in the future, maybe we should just enjoy the now. Enjoy the now? Am I doing it right? Yep. How about now? You got it. Hey, Flamingo. Yeah? Boo. <laughs> Enjoying the now is way better than worrying about the future. But peanut butter is still the worst. Who likes peanut butter? Raise a quiet hand. Who does not like peanut butter? Raise a quiet hand. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Who's allergic to peanut butter? 
I'm allergic to peanut butter. I see you out there. I see you're allergic to peanut butter too. What happened to the characters of the book at the beginning of the book to Potato and Flamingo? What were they feeling? Yeah, worried. They were worried about what was going to happen in the future. But do they know what's going to happen in the future? Or are, do they know what's going to happen in a few days? Or even tomorrow? No, right? And how were the characters of the book feeling at the end? Not as worried, that's right. Because their friend taught them how to enjoy the now. Let's bring Puppy and Snail back. Hey everyone. I really liked that book. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, I liked that book too. See, the thing is Puppy, I also used to feel worried a lot. Yeah, that's right. I used to want to hide in my shell and put my head down and not tell anyone, right? Yeah, I feel worried right now. I kind of want to do that. I kind of want to hide under the bed. That's understandable, puppy. There's a lot of things happening right now that are different than what I was used to before. Like I don't get to go to school and see my friends. Yeah, I don't get to eat lunch or see my teachers in person. Yeah, me too. But what I learned about were two really helpful things. Tell me, tell me, tell me. One is belly breaths. I know a lot of you already know about belly breathing and we're gonna practice again, okay? Let's do it right now. Here we go. Remember, we smell the flower and then we blow out the candle. Here we go, smell the flower. Blow out the candle. Do it one more time. Smell the flower. Blow out the candle. Sometimes it takes me three or four or five belly breaths in order to feel better. Yeah, that, wow, I, I already feel a little bit less worried. There's another thing. What is it? What is it? It's called positive self-talk. We've already talked about self-talk with Miss Golden. Yeah, I'm, I really like self-talk. I like talking to myself. Yeah, me too. Positive self-talk is when you say things that are positive to yourself. Can we try it right now? Yeah. Okay, here we go. Miss Golden, do you want to go first? Yeah, I'll go first. So is this, do you think this is positive self-talk or negative self-talk? I'm never going to see my friends again. Oh, forget it. No, I don't even want to do the Zoom meeting because I'm never going to see my friends again. Oh, is that positive self-talk? Yeah, mm, no. But how about this one? I'll see my friends again soon. And since I can't see them right now in person or at school, I'm going to go ahead and get on my Zoom meeting on the computer with my teacher and I'm going to see my classmates and some of my friends. Is that positive self-talk? Mm -hmm, certainly is. How about this one? Is this positive self-talk? I'm feeling a little sad, but I know everything will be okay. I'm with my family right now and that helps me to feel better. Is that positive self-talk? Yes, that's positive self-talk. Awesome. Okay. Kindergartners and first graders, today we talked about feeling worried. It's normal to feel worried. I want you to know that everyone feels worried sometimes. Puppy and Snail felt worried. I felt worried before. Now I do deep belly breathing and positive self-talk. I felt worried too. It's normal to feel worried. There are two things you can do to get through worrying. Belly breaths and positive self-talk. Jefferson students, I cannot wait to see you again. Look out for my next video coming out soon. Bye everyone, see you next time.